This is Bill Cridell of Fergana Partners. I have great pleasure today in interviewing Sasha, who is a PhD engineering student at Carnegie Mellon, one of the great institutes of our country, and Raymond, who is a, an MD neurosurgeon. They met at the Tepper Business School and have come up with an excellent plan for a new company called Neurobank. Uh, just as way of introduction for all of our viewers, for many years, researchers and doctors felt that the number of uh, neuronal cells in the brain was relatively fixed and then dying as you got older. And then a series of discoveries took place over the last 20 years in which it was discovered that neuronal stem cells were capable of self-renewal and self-repair and differentiation into various terminal fate cells that performed all the functions of the brain. Following that particular piece of knowledge with the precedent of uh, blood banking and, um, and, cell, um, and cell storage, these two young men have come up with a brand new business model and a new company called Neurobank. Tell us, what is the utility, Raymond, of Neurobank? Well, Neurobank allows people to store their very own neural stem cells for the future. So um, we think that certain groups are particularly motivated, those people who have been recently diagnosed with uh, conditions like spinal cord injury, traumatic brain injury, Parkinson's disease, and other injuries where there are ongoing uh, trials using uh, neural stem cells.